I have some scrap wood laying around the shop and I'm going to make a kind of stove top cover slash cutting board. There's some walnut and some hardwoods kind of mixed in here and I'm just going to kind of cut them up and piece them together and just kind of make a simple cutting board slash stove top cover for my camper here. So it'll be a fun little project for just some scraps I had left over here. This is more of a customized size for a stove top that I have, but it's still a lot of fun to make a simple cutting board. And, and really all I'm doing is just taking the scraps and making sure that they're all the, um, the same length. They don't really have to be the same width, um, but you know, a little bit closer to better. Um, when we put them all together like this, it's really kind of fun, especially at different color woods. I don't know about you, but I kind of enjoy this sound. It's really kind of soothing. Now I am using a butcher block that is food grade um, just to kind of get a good seal on it and also give a nice good shine to it. Um, you can kind of see it really helps those colors pop out of it there. After the first coat dried I did get a um, 400 grit sandpaper and go ahead and sand that down real nice and put another coat on there make it nice and smooth. And here's what the finished product looks like. Um, again, it's just a simple stovetop cover. And since we don't have a lot of room in the camper here, it's a good opportunity to just get a little bit extra space to be able to cut some food on or maybe just put on when we're not using it to hold some dishes or anything. So it works out great.